Okay, Jim, you can, it's your finished foot, three. <laughs> okay. The footbridge over the can mine. Can again? Sorry. Yeah. <laughs> So why don't we go? I thought it would be nice to uh, walk across uh, Eisenersteg, the footbridge across the mine. Um, it's a beautiful day today. It's a little bit windy, but uh, to me it's interesting. It reminds me of that bridge in Paris where so many lovers have put locks on the bridge. and. Uh, I understand the bridge in Paris, they've had to remove all of those locks because they were so heavy, but it looks like the Eisenersteg is still fest. Uh, it's just a very lovely place to come and imagine all of the people who have been here putting locks on the, on the bridge for their, to express their love for each other. Well, I think the one I've, I've been to the most is the Städel Museum. Um, and uh, I've been here at least once for the uh, Museums Fest, uh, which is really interesting. I, I went to several other museums. Uh, there's one, I think, for fabric art and, uh, and one for more modern kinds of, kinds of art. And, uh, but I think the Stadel probably uh, is still my favorite here. Well, um, in New York we have the Hudson River uh, or the East River and uh, they're both bigger than, than the mine. The life along the river is very similar. People are walking, they're riding their bicycles, there's the, the boats ready to take people up and down the river and uh, also just if you stand here long enough there's some very interesting kinds of boats that go under the bridge. And uh, so it, it reminds me somewhat of, of New York. And when I look and I see the European Central Bank off in the distance, that looks a little bit like the United Nations building on the East River. Well, it's been great to visit the Dome and the Römer and uh, now the Eisenersteg and uh, to see everything down by the river. Now, now maybe we could go further into the city to the...